This video is made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available on Amazon right now. Good morning and welcome to Ranger Rob Country Living. And uh, today is a big day for us because we're actually going to accomplish something that's just been driving us crazy. And that is a whole big pile of pots, hanging pots, that your father, sure he's with me, your father accumulated over the years. And uh, here, I'll, sh I'll show them to you real quick. Right over here. I get some very excited dogs today. All these pots, throughout the years, I think uh, Jay bought hanging baskets for his wife. And as the years, each season was over, he'd just bring the pots over here. Well, all these pots have a lot of good dirt. And uh, so, and they're, it's kind of an eyesore. And uh, so we're going to take those, dump them into, I don't know, a wheelbarrow, and then put them in the garden over there. And, uh, oh, look at that. By magic, it's open. It's magic. Yeah. Ta-da. So we're going to take that stuff, put it into the garden, and blend it in. And we're not getting, even the, even the plants that are left in there, I'm just going to mulch them in there. So, uh. It'd be really cool to get rid of this and I know it's dark in here but uh, we also have no space in here we have a whole bunch of old logs and stuff for a project that her father was working on on the lathe and all of this is going to go outside too so it's a big wheelbarrow day I'm using the tractor I don't know about you all right it's a tractor day so let's get to work. All right, well, Sherry's gonna get the tractor. And that's gonna be our mobile wheelbarrow today. Uh, she actually really likes to drive the tractor. Okay, so here's the plan. In the garden here, I'm going to spread this out with a uh, tractor later on. I have five yards of compost coming in by truck. And so we're going to blend that and the compost. And I also have five yards of uh, mulch coming in for the garden. And then we'll start spreading this. And, and then uh, once I get it all spread, 
I'm gonna rototill it all in and uh, when I'm satisfied we gotta do some measurements too and stuff when we're satisfied with all that we're gonna cover this garden up for the winter and uh, so in the meantime we got another project to do is to move all those logs out of the barn and get them over to a pile over here so this is a big burn pile but we're gonna reduce this burn pile steal stuff out of it for a compost bin so we're gonna reduce this a lot but over here is a lot of wood a lot of it I'm gonna give to my son for his uh, for his fireplace but we're gonna throw all the wood over here and that's gonna gain us a lot of room in the in the shop so we're pretty happy about that so once again let's get to work We did get the wood out of here. Doesn't really look like I gained that much room. <laughs> uh, lots of pots in here. And uh, we got all these cleaned out. Now we gotta do a dump run. A lot of those are uh, disintegrating so they're not good to keep. We interrupt this program for a little chicken watching time. Uh, nothing beats sitting back here <laughs> and just watching chickens. And uh, trying to keep Belle from terrorizing them too much and then Cinder her too she's here but uh I gotta tell you guys when or if you ever get chickens they are fun to watch and uh, we definitely enjoy them and ours are still growing up they're still gonna get two times bigger than they are right now but yep definitely quiet time good time to take a break and watch the chickens this is where we dumped all the wood uh, in a few weeks my son's going to come pick up a lot of this wood and then some of it we're going to use to weigh down the tarps for the garden and the garden <laughs> it looks ugly right now uh, spread out stuff a little bit I got like I said five cubic yards of uh, compost going in then we'll rototill it one more time and then we'll cover this whole thing with a tarp and then we decided over here we're going to devote this to uh, plants that spread out like uh, uh, squash, um, zucchinis, things like that because it already has a watering system built in and uh, apparently we can't put cucumbers they don't like water over the top so uh, this would be a beautiful next spring when everything's planted and growing uh, probably later spring and uh, we uh, still want to get a high tower put in over here. That'll probably be a winter project. We got a cabana I think we're putting up, going to think about putting in. And before we go today, I wanted to show you our new chickens. Not real chickens, but chickens we got off Amazon. Here we are. So I kind of spruce up the back of this. We also have one uh, installed up above here if you can actually see it. Uh, it's come way down here. <laughs> so, but there is a chicken above the door. And uh, you know, I kind of like it. Kind of uh, just gives it a little bit of chicken flavor. All right. But anyway, I want to thank you guys for listening, watching. And please like, like us right now. Take the time to hit the like button. Uh, subscribe if you're not a subscriber we'd really appreciate it and the next big thing we could ask you to do is share our videos all over the world <laughs> we appreciate it helps our channel grow so thank you for watching have a great day and thank you bye now thank you very much for watching our video please take the time to like subscribe and share our videos all over the whole wide world thanks